Don Carey has scored 10 in a row for Siena. It's Burns inside, and he muscles it up and in, and it's rebounded by King with 12 seconds left. King all the way to the rim, wild shot, follow jam, Gary Harris. Don Carey, his second foul, as he got tangled up down low. Pickett the steal. Pickett racing in one-on-one. -on -one. Pickett lays it up and in. Down low, nice feed to Burns, who gives Siena the lead. Eight offensive rebounds for Siena against just one for Canisius. Pickett running in for the left-handed layup. It's Brandon, he'll shoot a three. It's good! Majesty Brandon gives Canisius the lead. He's got 30. 10 seconds left. Canisius by two, Burns three for the lead. It's good! Elijah Burns gives Siena the lead. Five seconds left. Canisius one final shot. Johnson for the win! No good, Saints win! 73-72, the final. <laughs> just being, just kidding. But no, nah, I just was really, really relaxed in that play. Uh, I give a shout out to one of my former coaches on the baseline. And, you know, he said to me, "Just be confident. You're a good enough player to make the shot. And uh, if you get the chance, shoot it." And uh, so I was relaxed through the whole possession and just stepped up and knocked down the shot. Um, well, we've been working on rub screens late in the game and things like that out of transition. So I came off it and I realized two guys stayed with me and Elijah popped. And I'm confident in his ability to stretch the floor and knock down open shots. So, you know, I just looked back and he was there wide open. So I gave it to him and I knew he was going to make it. Understandably, Elijah pretty fired. Again, to piggyback off Jalen, it just shows how special uh, this group is, how resilient we are down double figures at halftime. And, you know, putting it together, Jalen came out with a few big steals to, you know, switch the momentum. It just shows how special this group is. We learned, right? Everyone wants to talk about the non-conference schedule. Well, that was the same action that happened against Harvard, and we didn't make the right read. I'm not calling a timeout when a team scores a basket so they can set their defense. I'm letting our guys make plays, and uh, you know we ran that rub screen out of transition, and uh, two came to the ball, and Jay made the right read, and Elijah had confidence to knock it down. So you know when it's all said and done, that non-conference game against Harvard got us ready to win this game, and now we're one and zero in the MAC. So I just told these guys, hey, they have to believe in each other, and, and we're here to do some, something special.